Hi everybody, and welcome once again to my Pirate 101 Let's Play. Sorry I couldn't get some videos out. I'm kind of slow in video, uh, getting some videos out, but hopefully I'll get better. Let's see what this says, hold on. Isle of Doom. Crown Gortez's followers, but they're not alone. The Armada's here too. Well, let's get to it then. Away we go. Okay, so let's check out a couple things. I've been reading the comments, so let's go to my companions. And let's click on, let's see, um, okay, I have four training points. Let's see if, I, if I'm doing this right. Someone mentioned new talent. Here we go. So, for instance, when I click on Batacuda, they say there's a new talent down here button. So, choose a new talent. We can choose, um, let's see, it could be accurate, agile, armored, rough, dodgy, strong, or tough. Um, gosh, this is a tough one. Which one shot? I would definitely say right now, let's go with strong. I'm going to purchase strong for Batacuda. I hope that's the right choice, but I definitely think it can help. Oh, we've got another new talent. Seems like there was more than one. Um, let's see. So let's get some accuracy. Don't you think that accuracy could be important? There we go. So I used two of those. Great. Now, um, Ratbeer needs to be, um, it seems that there's a little, um, exclamation point here. So I believe that means, I think this has to do with the fact that there's a quest for him. Uh, let's see, hold on one second here. The rat race, talk to Ratbeard. Any world, any island, any tavern cellar. Okay, um, okay, this one I believe I don't know if this is how, I'm not sure because like I say, I'm, I'm not the expert of Pyro, I'm not an expert here I just started playing, not, you know, since this Let's Play, so I'm wondering if this is how I can um, promote Ratbeard um, with this quest so let's see, this is pretty far off, I know everybody says I should promote him, so I should possibly take the time could really help me in my battles for instance, that last battle against that last boss is pretty rough and uh, I definitely need to get all the help I can. Let's go ahead and give this a shot. Um, okay, let's see where I'm going here. So I basically have to head back. Out of here, that is. Oh, lots of people online now. Sunday evening. This is a busy day for people to be playing my Pirate 101 or Wizard 101. So a lot of people here. So talk to Ratbeard in any tavern cellar. Let's see if we could get there. Obvious, obviously, it's not here in the gold, um, in this island. This is the gold mine, I believe. All right, I need to unbottle my ship first, so let's do that. I always forget which one. I think it's this one, the Zealous Falcon. There we go, that's the big ship. So let's go there. And let's head off to, because everyone keeps repeating that, and, and it's true, I really should promote Ratbeard, so let's get to it. Let's, uh, let's promote Ratbeard. I need to talk to him in any tavern cellar, so let's head somewhere. Close by, hopefully. Yeah, right here. This town. Which one was this one? I actually don't remember which one this is called. Let's see. What is it? Scrimshaw. Have I been here? You know what? I don't know if I've been there. At least I don't remember being there. You are now bound to Life Fountain here. Okay, no problem. Um, press X to leave ship. I don't think we've been on this island. At least I don't remember coming here. But there must be a tavern, so that's why we're here. I don't think we've done any questing here at all. At least I don't remember if we have. Possibly. I forget sometimes, so <laughs> I could be wrong. All right, here we go. There's a tavern. Perfect. Let's head in here and deal with Ratbeard and see what he has to tell us. All right, so what we want to do is go down to the cellar area, right? That's where we always have to go. Always the fun things happen. Oh, these are like our companions. Oh, yeah, cool. Oh, my gosh, it's all of our companions. So all the sellers are the same, I guess. That's pretty awesome. All righty. I was preparing to go after Gun's Gold. I needed to raise some money to recruit me lads and impress the Waponies. I sold me best blade and captain's finery to Bill Bobstay, a pawnbroker in Scrimshaw. Well, I reckon it's time we got them back. If we can find a way into Trade Wind Skyway, I ask for the chance to seek out old Bill and get my gear back. What say ye? Okay, talk to Bill Bobstay in Hole in the Wall Tavern. 
Alrighty, hole in the wall tavern. I hope it's here. Of course it won't be here. Oh, it is here. Oh, awesome. It is in this tavern. Cool. They don't send me like then? somewhere far away. Ratbeard. Oh, we've done our share of business. I took some of his things, yes. A blade and a right smart suit of clothes, as I recall. <laughs> Had to sell it all, I'm sorry to say. The clothes went to Twitchy Jake Creedy, an old friend of Captain This Ratbeard, guy would be good to have as a companion. Do we get him as a companion too? That black-hearted skunk of a rat is no friend oh, of mine. Oh, Ratbeard doesn't like I'll him, take though. My things back by force if need be. That's your business, not mine. I think Creedy and his crew have taken up in the dockside warehouse if you want your things back. Okay. Look for Twitchy Jake Creedy. Oh gosh, how am I gonna Okay, look for Twitchy Great Jake Jake Creedy in Dockside Warehouse. Here we go. Alright, I guess this is the warehouse, I could say. Not really much of a sign there. If it wasn't for the little arrow, I'd have no Oh no. I oh no. Defeat Who's Twitchy J. Creedy. Look That's what I was. Uh, this you guy's gotta become our companion. Come on. I like him. Standing behind you. A fine coat I found, isn't it? I figure it pays back. Ha. Oh, you Half of what you owe me, it. sorry. Well, that's fine by me. Boys. Oh no. No, 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 no. Okay, um. <laughs> we're gonna start a fight again, so. Just wanna check out my companions yes. again. Someone mentioned I can change the order of my companions. Um, so, like, if I wanted, if I wanted Batacuda to be first, can I do that? Yes. So Batacuda can always be like the first guy chosen instead of Can Po. And then I can have like yes. Dead Mike. Wow, they're really low level. I need to bring them up, but I only have four. I mean, I do have some training points, but it takes a while. And yes. let's say old scratch for now. Oh, I need Bonnie Hi. Ann. Bonnie Ann's got to be actually the first one, right? There we go. All right. All right, let's go. In. I should have trained them, right? Um, probably should have done that. Let's do that before I get started. You guys are all yelling at the screen. Train! Okay, let's train Bonnie Ann. Nice. We are at level nine, Bonnie Ann. Good job. I think Bonnie Ann is a good one to train up as much as I can. So let's get another training point. And we got her to 10, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Very nice. What now? And this guy, let's see, old scratch. Anyone close to being leveled up? Yes, Captain. Let's see. Mormo is pretty low. Yes. yes. Let's go with... Yes. I'm going to put yes, the, all the points to Bonnie Ann. Let's give her another training point. All right, let's get into this fight. Let's defeat Twitchy Jake. We definitely can do this. This is simple. Come on. <laughs> I say that, but I really don't know. Come on, Batacuda. Let's see how strong Batacuda is. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it just says defeat Jake Creedy's, right? So we don't really have to worry about his his nasty um helpers or bodyguards or whatever you want to call them. Alrighty. Um hmm. We only have two companions with us here. Um quick Billy. Twitchy J. Creedy. Here he is. He's the bottom guy. So let's see how how close. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. That's okay. That's okay. I did it. Just make some movements because we're pretty far off from them. All right. Here they come. They're still far off, so that's good for me. At least they can't attack me just yet. All right. Next. Next. Uh, next attack. Let's see what we got here. All righty. Um... Everybody says I should use this. This definitely buffs us up for the, all the attacks. Um, let's have Batacuda attack. Oh, I just want to go to Jake. This guy. To Jake. Um, but I can't reach. So let's attack this guy. Do the best we can. Uh, oh, doo -doo -doo. Let's go here. And let's have um, Ratbeard go here. All done. All done. Got it. Got it. I got to move quicker. I'm moving too slow lately. Come on. There's the chicken. I love the chicken. Give us all a little bit of a boost there with Mr. Chicken. All right, Batacuda. Batacuda's pretty cool. He's uh, he's a strong guy. He's level 13. He's doing good. I like it. Ooh, that nice little, uh, the fin attack there. He's got his fin attack or tail, tail fin attack. Sorry. Oh, they're all getting closer. We just need to attack the one guy. What's his name? 
I forgot his name right. Creedy? Whatever it is. All right, let's go for him directly now that they're all close enough. Now, um, let's see what I got here. What do I got? What's a good one? Um, okay, let's attack. Is this Jake Creedy? All right, got him. Now, we want Batacuda to attack. Bonnie Ann, if we use the scatter. There we go. And now we want to use um, Ratbeard. Also against Twitchy. Twitchy. That's what I'm going to call him. Twitchy. Come on. Let's do some nice. Nice. I like it. I <laughs> love that attack is good. Come on, Ratbeard. Do some damage. Oh, come on. No blocking. Batacuda's good, though. Come on, Bonnie Ann. There we go. Scatter shot, right? Awesome. Thanks, guys, for helping me out with that. I appreciate it in the comments. All right. Come on. Super hit. No, not on my Batacuda. No. <laughs> Batacuda's strong. He's got some tough fish skin there. He's. Oh, ouch. Well, he got some damage, but <laughs> it's not too bad. Nice. Yes. Twitchy is down. That was easy. Oh, do we have to. Oh, no. Please don't tell me we have to bring them all down. Come on, guys. Give me a break here. Why do we have to attack? Why can't we just get the one boss and that's it? Oh, make my life hard. Come on. Oh, I was sure we were going to do this one. Alrighty. Um, let's see. Um, who's down on life? Let's attack this guy. Alright, we'll have Batacuda also. Uh, let's have Batacuda attack him. He's almost go a goner. Then we'll have Bonnie Ann attack Hi, here. Captain. And we'll also have... There we go, just in case. Hopefully, we'll bring two of them down. Oh, nice. Oh my gosh, don't tell me I did it. Yes! Good for me, but I shouldn't have had another... I always do that, and then another companion is supposed to attack, and I lose that attack. So it's kind of a bummer. Alright, two of them are down. I should be happy. I'm happy about that. I am. Bonnie Ann's going to do some damage to sure will carry. That's good. Ouch, Batacuda. Be careful, Batacuda. Batacuda is an awesome companion. You don't realize how awesome it is until you see him in battle. He is great. Alrighty. Um, so we're down to this just this one guy. There's not much else to do but just attack him directly. And not worry about it because we are done in this turn. Alright, that was pretty easy. Come on, that was simple. It's one of the easier um, fights. There we go. He's gone. You're just one hit and he was down. All right, guys, let's do this. <laughs> Treasure chests. Let's grab them. Let's grab them. Any others? Oh, okay. Take your coat and hat, you <laughs> brat. Could hardly stand the smell of them anyway. <laughs> your sword? I know nothing of that. I only bought your kit from Bob's Day. Go ask him where it is. All right, go back to talk to Bill Bob's Day in Hole in the Wall Tavern. Head back to Hole in the Wall Tavern, which is right over here. John Morris is guarding the door. <laughs> He's a nasty little rat-looking guy. <laughs> Alrighty, let's head down, right? Oh no, here he is. Bill Bob, stay right. He's not downstairs. He's the right here. was purchased by One-Eyed Jack over in Flotsam. An old friend of yours, yes? We'll see about that. If Jack's up to something, there'll be the devil to pay. Uh, talk to One-Eyed Jack. One-Eyed Jack must be far off. Let's see where he is. The black spot. I definitely need to get some kind of, um... Some kind of mount here, because I move really slow. <laughs> really slow, and I don't have a mount. I like that ship to the left, huh? Nice! Really nice! I don't know, a nice flag they made! Very cool. Alrighty. They must be a higher level than me. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, let's launch our ship. Here we go. Oh, wrong way. Turn around, turn around. Okay, let's go on the skyway here. So let's head over to... What is it? Cutthroat Bay? Talk to one eye Jack. No, in the black spot. Okay. Just heading in that direction. Luckily, it shows always a big number, and I'm always afraid it's far, but it really isn't. Oh, it is far. Now it says 5,000. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is far. All right, let's head off. Just working on my ship. Um, I mean, trying to maneuver my ship. I'm not very good as an ocean person in real life, so... <laughs> 
I'm not a really a boat, you know, I'm more of a land lover myself. But, uh, you know, in the game, it's okay. I can do it. I'm trying to maneuver it the best I can. Alrighty. Hopefully getting there soon. Where are we headed there? Have we ever been to this area before? I don't think so. I don't remember this at all, actually. I mean, I don't remember this area at all. Well, no, the lighthouse. We've been by the lighthouse, haven't we? I think so. Talk to one eye. Maybe I've been to the black spot, actually. All right, well, we'll see now when we go visit one eyed Jack in the black spot. We're almost there. Almost there. Wrap up. No! Oh, gosh, I got caught up. I didn't even see that ship. It just came out of nowhere. <laughs> oh, my gosh, it's so annoying. All right, um, this is easy. Just wasting my time, actually. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Sorry, I got caught up, guys. Happens every once in a while. This should be easy. I, I didn't even see. It just came right up. I was going fast, and the Waponi canoe or ship or whatever it was came up, and nothing I can do. Those little Waponis got in the way. <laughs> Ata Leku, Waponi Spearman. We fought these guys before for some quest. Actually, we fought quite a few of them. We had to, we had to fight a lot of them, actually. Ouch, Batacuda. Sorry about that, buddy. It's funny how you don't have to go to the life fountain once you finish a fight. Like, your companions always regain full life after a fight. They, I don't know if that should be changed. That could be interesting, you know? Because, you know, in my mind, I guess I think that they should really, you know, have this... Like, for instance, if I had low life after a fight, I still have the low life after the fight. I don't automatically get full life back. I have to go to life fountain or get those little... You know, those little life pellets, or whatever you want to call them. So, I don't think your companions should just have life all of a sudden. I mean, it makes it easier, but I don't know. I'm not really sure. I mean, I think my opinion would be more like, you know, try to um, be more realistic in the sense that, you know, your companion should be exactly have the same life as the, you know, when the fight ends. So, anyway. Just my opinion. Sorry. Doesn't mean I'm right. Doesn't mean I'm right. Could make it just a lot of running around for nothing. Could be that. You know, like, if it was that way, I would have to keep going back to Life Fountain, which is pointless because then you get full life back, so maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, guys, I could be wrong. Don't worry. <laughs> just sometimes like to state what I'm thinking, but doesn't mean I'm right. I'm sure if it was that way, I would not be happy. Alright, that was easy. Come on, let's move on. There we go, all done. Yes, happy, happy, jumping up and down, grab a chest. Is there only one? There we go. All right, let's get... Oh, no, 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 do not deal another pony. Oh, there's some fish in the way. We just don't want to deal with any of these guys. Be very careful. So we're going to this big mess. I think we've been here, haven't we? Flotsam, yes. Oh, was I supposed to go to Flotsam? Huh. I don't know if it was in Flotsam. I might have made a mistake. Let's see. Let's see what it shows me here. Hmm. I'm not really sure. In the black spot. Is the black spot here? You know what? It's not very clear. Oh, yeah. Now, now, now we're good. Okay, so I was right. This was the right way. Woof. Thought I was going the wrong way. Sorry about that. So the black spot is in Flotsam. Let's head back this way. Yeah, I remember being in all these crazy little paths and stuff. It's insane. Let's see, am I going the right way now? I could have just missed it. Oh, no, we're going right. Going good. Are we hoisting down? All right, let's go. Hoist. Okay, and now we are... Oh, this is it. It's like a tavern thing. The black spot. We found it. There we go. A little delay there getting in there. Okay. There we go. At the very end is One-Eyed Jack. Hey, one eye Oh, yeah, this is the little Hello, rabbit guy. I remember him. Pirates. You and Ratbeard have sorted out your differences, I see. <laughs> Piracy makes strange bedfellows. If I'm right, Ratbeard has come looking for his blade. Well, don't get cross. I bought it to hold it safe for you. Least I could do for an old friend. Ratbeard, your sword is hidden in one of my rental properties, a cabin not far from here. Enjoy. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll claim my favor later. Okay, collect the blade in Summer Rental. Alright, let's head over there to Summer Rental. 
Back in the hoist again. Alrighty. Where is summer rental? This is a big crazy mess of paths that makes me crazy. Look at that companion. Did you see him? He's like a ghost. I loved it. That was awesome. Oh my gosh, I hope that was a witch doctor. I really didn't see what, what type of character that was. Be cool if I get that companion. I like that companion. Where am I going? Is it... Oh, it might be down here. Sorry. It might be down on this ship. Uh, right down here, possibly. Looks like it. Summer rental. Oh, so the boat is a summer rental. Got it. Oh, you know there's some big battle here, right? Let's see, where are we? Collect the blade in summer rental. Oh, gosh. Let's see. Um, all right. Well, before we start any battle, because I'm afraid. Let's see how we're doing here. Um, hold on. Well, I'm afraid we're going to... No, maybe we don't need to battle. Press X. It's a chest. Here's my blade at long Good. Okay. Oh, no. Defeat Lasko. I told you there's always a battle. Oh, no. It's one of the ghost people. <laughs> oh, gosh. And you, pirate. That eel. He was supposed to catch Rampy to stop him, but she took him on your crew. How dare you. Poisoned? I never poisoned you. I just meant to put you to sleep. Not, well, to put you to sleep. <laughs> oh no, evil spirits and stuff. What is it? Only, how, how many, oh, I do have three companions. Okay, um. Defeat all enemies. See, it specifically says up there, I have to remember that. Defeat all enemies. I always mess that up. All right, so let's get this. And let's get Batacuda going here. And we'll have, uh, let's see, Dead Mike Reaches. Good. And we've got Ratbeard right here. Oh, gosh, this is, I have a feeling this is going to be a brutal fight. Brutal. Chicken, increased will, increased strength, increased strength, increased strength, everybody. <laughs> That's what you guys told me to do. Very smart. Every time we first attack, I should use the chicken. Oh, gosh, this is, it looks a little difficult. This doesn't look easy. Come on, Dead Mike, you can do this. Oh, yeah, I like it. Little little martial arts with your uh, sword. Nice. Oh, old Bart doesn't look happy. Ouch. Hey, that reminds me of the guys in um in Wizard 101, right? They're floating, what are they called? Like ghouls. I want to say floating. They're not ghouls, though. I forgot what they're called. Looks just like them from Wizard 101. Very similar. Alrighty, so what do we got here? Uh, let's use this attack. This is going to attack a few guys, right? Then we've got Batacuda attacking. Okay, and then we've got... um. Oh, we've got Dead Mike, so let's have him attack. There we go. Let's see if we get two guys down in this shot. Come on. Nice. The hands say it all. They're all attacking. Oh, still has a lot of life, actually. Dead Will. Oh, Radbeard's attacking. Oh, the way he disappears. Oh, a little electricity there. I'm scared. Ouch. All right, Batacuda, come on. Come on, come on, you can do it. Please tell me about Bart. Yes! Yes! One down! One down! <laughs> perfect! It was perfect! Oh no, now they get to attack me. I, I don't like that part, guys. <laughs> I like when I'm only attacking. Ouch. Okay, come on, Dead Mike. Stay alive for me. I know you got three of those nasties around you, but block them. Block them. Come on, Rat Beard. Don't take on any damage. I need you guys to stay alive. Come on, we can do this. Come on, we pretty much got their boss down, I think, so... No, not a mega hit on me! No! Oh, ouch. Oh, gosh, again? That was a lot of damage, actually. All right. Let's get into this. Come on, we could bring another one of these guys down. So, um, let's see. I can get some health back. Let's drain some health here. And then we've got Batacuda attacking. We've got Dead Mike attacking. And I'm going to have... Um, how much life does he have? Yeah, we're going to have... Um, Ratbeard attack there. I hope this is good. I hope we bring one of them down here. It might be close because if one of them blocks Then I won't be able to bring him down. Let's hope. Good. I got some life back. A little bit, a little bit. Every little bit helps. Come on, Matacuda. Do some serious damage. Nice. Okay, hopefully 
Dead Mike will bring that guy. Ooh, that was a lot. Minus 44. Oh, good. Okay, good job. We got one of them down. Two to go. Two to go. Old Bart, evil spirit. Oh, no, Rapbeard, stay alive, please. I'm <laughs> sorry. I just, I get all crazy with this. Like, it's just, ugh. Some serious damage. All right. Enough already. Come on, old Nick, enough. You're one nasty evil spirit. Come on. All right. We're, we're still okay. Ratbeard is just barely alive. Um, actually, no, no. Let me just... Uh, let's do this on... Right here. And let's have Batacuda also attack here. And we will have Dead Mike attack. And Ratbeard. I think it attacks both of them, actually. Come on, just keep Ratbeard alive during this one. Just don't want him to die because um, I don't know what's coming after this. So, and I'm pretty sure. Oh, good. One down, one down. One to go. Come on. We can do this. This turn. So, we are done. Vengeance strike. Come on, Batacuda. Yes. We are done. That was easy. Okay, let's collect the chests. Is there any, any other ones? Well, I thought getting the old kid and sword back would make me feel like a new rat. But after hearing what became of the old crew, I never have harmed a hair on those boys' heads. Oh, I trick them out of their share of the treasure. <laughs> yeah, he'll trick them out of their share of the treasure. That's just pirating. Let's get back to the tavern. I have some thinking to do. Alrighty, cool. Very good. We did it. Anything else here we can grab? Any chest I should open? Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to stop the video a sec. I had a small technical problem, but we're back. You didn't miss anything, don't worry. So we have to talk to Ratbeard in any tavern cellar. So, um, let's head over there. In any tavern cellar. So let's head over to the tavern. Almost done here. Sorry about that. I did have a weird glitch and my system just kind of froze and I couldn't get back in the game. It was really weird actually, but really doesn't happen too often. But when it does, it's only when I'm recording. Otherwise, <laughs> otherwise it would never happen. Trust me on this one. All right. So let's see what um, the black spot again. So we want to go down. Talk to Radbeard in the cellar. That's right. That's where all my companions are always hanging out in the cellar. It's not always a good thing, is it? <laughs> okay, here are all my companions, so let's talk to Ratbeard. Captain, I'm sure them drops I bought were knockout drops. Somebody else must have slipped me poison. I means to find out just who did it. And that day, there'll be a reckoning. Till then, I guess I'll try your brand of piratin'. I'm glad to be on your crew, Captain. You've shown me the error of me old ways. <laughs> okay, he's now a commander. Yes, we did promote Ratbeard. He has been promoted. So thank you guys. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. I know you guys were waiting for that and thank you for helping me out with it. So all done. We have now promoted Ratbeard. He is, he is now a commander and he's wearing very cool clothing, by the way, I must say. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hopefully that'll help us in our fights because now we promoted Ratbeard. We've also, um, the, uh, Batacuda has a new talent. So pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with that. So thank you so much for watching. Remember to leave a like so I know you're enjoying this um, this Let's Play. And uh, thank you for all the comments. Keep them coming. Any advice or anything you want to mention, please go ahead. I do read them all. Anyway, guys, have a wonderful day. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode. So take care, everyone.